of course you have to ask the right questions. You know, here it says, I hate cats. I want a dog scan. A cat scan, dog scan. <laughs> if you get a lot of palpitations, you should talk to your doctor. Do you feel them? Do you feel, are you drinking caffeine not to sleep because, oh, oh well then it's not caffeine, it's alcohol. No, no, no. <laughs> just late night. Welcome to my world. <laughs> I'm Gladys Velarde. I am the medical director of the Women's Heart Program and director of the Cardiovascular Fellowship at UF Jacksonville. So we talk about heart disease when we talk about heart attacks. We talk about heart disease when we talk about stroke. We talk about heart disease when we talk about peripheral arterial disease. So cardiovascular disease means all of that. I always tell my patients, we are an orchestra of organs, and when one instrument is out of tune, the orchestra doesn't function very well. You know, I'm not the conductor of the orchestra, but I think it is important to realize that the, the cardiovascular system is front and center of what happens, and, and many uh, areas of the body uh, depend on the heart to function well and affect the heart in turn. That's why this program is so important, because many of the Themes that you have come to learn, whether it is rheumatology, the stress modification, behavior, all of that affects your cardiovascular system. If you empower the patients to know what they should be asking, what should my blood sugar be? What should my cholesterol be? Then you're empowering the person, the patient, to really take ownership of, its, of their own health.